Talwis. Talwis. Masa- Masama ako. <laughs> Hello YouTube, Boss Trino, welcome to my channel. So ito tinayin natin, The Darkest Secret, pero bago ang lahat. Isubscribe nyo muna itong Tara Food Trip by Boss Trino, kung trip nyo. Dahil, bakit Boss Trino YYI? Mali pa yata, babaguhin ko nga yan. Eh, dahil ito ay monetized na itong channel na to ha? Oo, monetized na yan, kaya ano, ah... Uh, May ads yan. <laughs> so, ito, The Darkest Secret. Ang pabagay ito, extreme horror video that will drive you insane. So, ready na kayo. Magtipla muna kayo ng boss nilo copy sa Shopee at sa TikTok kayo makakabili. So, tirahin natin ito bago patirahin ng iba. Today, we present six extreme horror videos that will make you go crazy. O, oh, mababaliw daw kayo dito ha. Kaya, ayus-ayusin nyo. Number six. The following is a shocking recording published on the YouTube channel, Lupus Gamer, where the woman you see on the screen began a game together with her daughter to perform an invocation ritual called Sarita Sarita. This consists of throwing coins and asking questions. Supposedly, Sarita's spirit will answer the question using the result of the coins. Ay, maganda to. But who is Sarita? It is said that Sarita was an indigenous girl who made a pact with the devil. She was forever condemned to know everything but to live in limbo for all eternity. Look at the result that Lupus Gamer achieved from this ritual. Natakot ako sa kilay ni ate. At, uh, yung kilay ni ate, doon ako natakot. Look at the result that Lupus Gamer achieved from this ritual. Una vez logres entrar, puedes consultar a las monedas cualquier cosa que se responda con ella. Tres opciones. ¿Cómo pasar el examen? ¿Tendré pareja? ¿Mi madre se curará? Hay, sin embargo, cuestiones que es mejor no realizar en este juego. Preguntas como... Oh, oh my God. No sé. Oh, muchachos, se quebró algo arriba y no hay nadie. Estamos completamente sola, Regina y yo. ¿Hala? ¿No hay nada? Creepy naman ang bahay na to. ¿Ba't ganito yung bahay na to? No hay nada quebrado, no hay nada tirado. ¿Se quebró algo? ¿Se sí. Algo, se, quebró. se escuchó que se cayó algo y se quebró. Se escuchó que se cayó algo y se quebró, pero no. Y nahulog daw. No hay nada. ¡Naco, pucha! Ay, no hay nada. Yo, yo, yo. Hasta el pantalón de Saúl que se cambió y se fue. Todo está... ¿Qué rayos? La hilo o sacada. Sarita, Sarita, ¿podemos entrar al juego? Sí, sí, sí. Sí. ¡Ya! Uy, se está, va a casi miga o hayo. ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué pasó? No sé, algo. Oh, creepy en bajay. Inexplicable noises and strange shadows are the things that her followers began to notice yeah. and leave in the comments. However, the most shocking thing would occur near the end of the recording, where the camera witnesses the truly impossible. Sarita, Sarita. Tal vez. Tal vez. Masa <laughs> But ganun? Magugulatin na ako, bunyema. Sa gulo ako sa kamay. The situation gets completely out of control, managing to capture a hand that should never have been there. So they decided to abruptly end the game. Where did that hand come from? Who did it belong to? It is something that they did not want to investigate. A clear example is that rituals like these are not a simple game. And if they are not taken with the seriousness required, they could have significant consequences. Number three. Alam niyo yung gulat ko? Side effect to ng pag-explore. 
Hindi naman ako gato dati. Dati na, na alam niyo nagugulat ako dati sa jump scare lang. Hindi jump scare 'yun. Sa sigaw pa lang ni Ate, nagugulat na ako. Ba pag pagtagal-tagal ito, pag tanda ko ng kaunti, mali-mali ako. Epekto ng ano yan, side effect ng ano, ng pag-e-explore. Busita sa pag-e-explore to eh. Ba't ba napunta ako sa pag-e-explore? This video is nothing short of spectacular. Subtle, but spectacular nonetheless. You see, Naomi Guadalupe is the subscriber who in my email claims to still be shocked after witnessing a disturbing situation on a live broadcast on social networks. She says that one of her neighbors began to convey the unfortunate consequences of a fatal traffic accident that occurred near his house. It is a situation that from sad became disturbing when during the transmission, the blue blanket Wasak na wasak yung sasakyan, kawawa naman. Okay, that covered the only body that was still in the vehicle mysteriously rose. In fact, it stayed like that until the end. Watch. Ay, ay, bumangon yung ano, ano ba yan? Wasak na wasak yung sasakyan, kawawa yung driver or kung sino man nakasakay dyan. Bakit tumayo yan? Bakit gumalaw yun? Ito, ba't gumalaw? Tumayo? I remind you that this was a live broadcast of an extremely delicate and otherwise sad event that ended with the lives of a few people. So just thinking about possible manipulation is already quite reprehensible. However, this does not seem to be the case. Whoever was doing the broadcast was as baffled as Naomi. Could it be due to the action of the wind? Or do you think something lifted the canvas? Let me know what you think. Ayan o tumayo o. O tumayo yan. Number two. Siguro nakarobas yan. The following video comes from Mark Steininger, a subscriber from Nevada who attached a fragment of one of his many urban explorations. Mark tells me that he plans to create a travel-based YouTube channel. But first, he's training. He tells me that he hates the way his voice sounds. But above all, but how monotonous his videos sound, which is why twice a week and at night when there are not many people on the streets, he goes out and records himself vlogging. He has no plans on uploading these videos. In fact, he deletes them, except the one he wanted to share with us. He says that two weeks ago he went out at night and passed by a cemetery. He took out his camera and started recording. He tried to give a paranormal tone to his voice, but it didn't come out. He deleted everything he recorded in the cemetery, and then continued walking. The video that you now see on the screen is the continuation of that night. Out of modesty, he avoided speaking in front of others. He recorded 15 more minutes, Whoa, and his night was over. Mark sent me these 15 minutes of recording since he's sure he caught something strange. I'll leave you a summarized version to see if you can figure it out for yourself. What's this? Ah. Church. Church. Okay. Okay. Andilim boy, I'm gonna go here. How? How can I go here? Uh, Whoa! Para may meron siya daanan. Oh, very dark. Very dark here. Very dark. Ah! Putang ina mo, puno lang pala. Ay, sorry. Puno lang pala, hayop ka. Okay. Okay, now, uh, the way. Behind these uh, trees. Mm. 
Let's go. Ang haba. Ano ba meron dito? What's this? Tama ba ako nakikita? Huh. Huh. Ano ba pinapalood natin? Yay! Huwag kang danda. Ayoko nang ganyan paling. Wow. Ano Wow. Nen. Cross, cross. Cross. Oh, ini onion. Wah. Punya maskan ni. What the fuck? Wala ko na, wala ko na gets. Did you see anything strange? Mark says that he saw something here. Yeah, meron yun. Something that could be related to the cemetery. You see, he tells us that being among the tombs, he felt strange, as if insecure. However, he did not perceive anything else, despite that sensation. He also felt it here too. Now, look at this section of the video. I will highlight it with color correction. Sabi ko na kaluluwa yung umaakit na yun eh. Oh, ayan oh, parang kaluluwa. Hindi siya ano eh. Oh, ayan oh, hindi siya... Hindi siya solid. Sabi ko na eh, medyo chubby pa nga eh. Is that a person? Does it look like a normal sized person to you? I find it curious. First notice the size of that adult man who passes by before. Then notice this possible woman. She's huge, don't you think? Ay, ang laki nga. Para sa incredible look. However, we are not here for that reason specifically. Let's continue. Did you notice something next to the tree? Doesn't it seem to be a woman? An almost imperceptible woman. Ah, Look at it with zoom. Eh, oh my god, may nakaupo. Ang talas naman naman. Ang hirap yung edit niyan. Could it just be a person standing there? The strange thing is that seconds before, when he's walking towards there, no one is seen. It was too late. See? This is the tree. Next to it, you can see that person. Here, Mark says he felt something, oh but the camera God. doesn't capture anything. What happened? Is this a specter? Or could it be just a person standing there? Comment what you believe. My God. Yan ang espiritu. Number one. And the footage that ends our video comes from a disturbing live clip that okay, a subscriber pinana. sent us. From Chile, he says that the woman you see on the screen is called Helu Sukni, a well-known lawyer 
who has become noted for representing and defending thieves and traffickers in court. A well-known lawyer who has become noted, criminals who in some cases she has set free. A controversial figure who usually makes live links on her Instagram account. Well, it was in one of her lives while followers noticed what they described as a presence when she was alone at home. Could it be that way? See for yourself. Baka, creepy nung babae. Ay, meron sa likod to, sigura. Ah! Pero nga, okay, Tim, nawala. Boom! Wala niya mo sa banks. The woman confirms that at that moment, she was alone at home, ensuring that she does not know who the young man who appears on the screen is. A somewhat misaligned young man, My who God. according to some, fits the stereotype of people she usually represents in court. This image has had such an impact in Chile that quite a few have dared to say that it could be one of her deceased clients, perhaps one who has even died in prison. A more than valid hypothesis, but one that unfortunately we cannot guarantee because we only have her version of it. Could what we see here actually be a ghost? Let me know what you think in the comment box. Because this... Nakagulat eh. eh. Kung tao man yan, nakakagulat pa rin. We start this investigation with an extremely strange video. Something that naturally cannot be. It was sent to our email by Womack Mason. For him, this goes beyond something paranormal. For him, this is something demonic. The huh? recording captured by a security camera shows what was later learned to be the fatal fall of a citizen of Haitian origin inside a supermarket. However, for Womack, what is disturbing lies in the strange way in which the man collapses. I will show you the video. But I tell you that due to YouTube policies, I will not show the full accident. Yeah. Observe. Uy, but ganyan ang kamay niya. Parang aswa! Ayari! Tumaob! We all know the term sudden death. A sudden death generally occurs due to heart failure. However, for our subscribers, there is something that doesn't add up here. Strangely, he falls so suddenly to the ground, as if he had been knocked down, and it even seems like something is pulling his leg. Did you see it? Uy, gago, di niya gagawin yan. Kasi kung gagawin niya yan, bababagok talaga ulo niya. Boom! If it was a heart attack, he should have fallen slowly, holding his chest. He should have collapsed naturally, not as if an enormous force had slammed him to the floor. Furthermore, we cannot overlook a key aspect, the voodoo of Haitian culture, a practice shrouded in mystery and terror. In these ceremonies, not only rituals are performed, but there is a belief in the possibility of pacts with dark entities. Beings that are far from our understanding. For our subscribers, this case could be a reflection of these practices. Can you imagine that power existing? Can you imagine that what happened here is that a third party caused this by invoking inexplicable entities? An idea. Ah, no, walang walang taong bumabagsak ng ganyan, 'di ba? Kung yan ay nahimatay, hindi ganyan ang bagsak niya. Yeah, that for our peace of mind. I hope it is wrong. You can't fight something like that. What do you think? If you believe this was natural, can you explain it? Para may humila ng ano niya, no, ng paa niya, pero malamang niya bubagsak yung buka niya sa simento. Hindi lang pinakita ni The Darkest Secret kasi bawal. I will read your comments. Number five. Number five. From the Dominican Republic, 
Jeffrey wrote to my email, showing me a recording captured again by a security camera, but this time presenting us with a completely different context. According to him, what you will see next is a looping spectrum, a ghost that passes over and over again on the screen and that behaves in the same way. Could it be true? Pay attention. Pay attention. Wow! May anino dito! May ano, parang usok. Ayan, ayan! Nakita nyo? It cannot be a reflection of light since it occurs even when there is no vehicle there. It is not smoke and suspension either, since its shape is quite defined. Notice it maintains its shape throughout the entire journey. Lasing ba yung ano, yung oh. sasakyan? Parang lasing yung sasakyan na gater. What catches my attention the most is that if you look closely, the Ayan, scene oh, seems oh. to repeat itself. As ah, if that okay, may hums. scene were indeed trapped in a kind of time loop. Do you notice that? Ayan o? If you remember, we have already touched on this topic in previous episodes. Beings that seem to perpetually repeat what were their last moments of life. This phenomenon makes me think, are these apparitions a glimpse of a world beyond our own? Or perhaps, a reminder of old mistakes? Or more importantly, a sign for the living. Are they trying to communicate? Questions to reflect on. Para sinusundan niya yung sasakyan, ano? What do you think? Something paranormal? Or something with an explanation? Leave it in the comments. Number 4 Ito, meron akong gustong ano yun dito. Meron pa ito eh. Isa pa, bonus, bonus. Paranormal Brothers is a YouTube channel dedicated to the study of ghosts and specters. They usually go to houses or events where paranormal things have been reported, and they go out to investigate with tools such as spirit boxes. What makes them different is that they have a dog that usually detects abnormalities before they do. That was occurring in this video. The dog had started to sense strange things in this house and they took out their tools to detect whatever was there and look at the result. What's up? Yeah, what's Ooh. up, man? You just said my name. Huh? Oh my god, make us have a That's a dog. <laughs> I got my spirit box running. Ah, uh, spirit. Spirit. On. Spirit. A spirit box, Chen. Legit, Chen. Spirits to pick on my dog. I give you permission to pick on him. Don't hurt him, just pick on him. Can you call him downstairs? Can you make a noise so he can hear you? Oh, good First, first the ghost says cat out loud. And one of the brothers laughs because the ghost mistook the dog for a cat. But the dog stays alert. Mark, one of the brothers, asks the ghost to go up the steps. Observe the dog's reaction. But most importantly, Notice the orbs that begin to be seen for the first time during the recording. Spirits, can you walk up the steps? No, compo. I want to capture you on video. Oh, losing focus, losing focus. Oh my god. Do you see it? 
then makes Cameron start to lose focus, something he later confesses is extremely odd. At the same time, his dog runs off to look for whatever it is that he perceives. Could this be real? Number 2 Lamay number 2 pala to. Wow! Ano pala to? Five ano pala to? Ay, nakakatakot yung may kamay kanina. Nagulat ako. Nakakatakot yung may kamay kanina. Nagulat ako. <laughs> <laughs>